Hi. Come on in. I'm getting ready to go to the Met Gala tonight. It was an easy day at the office, I guess. <laughs> a very special evening, particularly because they are honoring Karl Lagerfeld. Well, first of all, it's a tremendous privilege and honor to be asked, and then to have his team create a couture dress for this evening. It feels like a really good way to remember him, the artistry he's brought to the fashion business. But as an artist, someone who I've always had great respect and admiration for. He was a true artist in every sense of the word. He was a visionary. He not only sketched his brilliant ideas, he photographs, he, he did so much, not just for the fashion business, but I think how he incorporated art, fashion, creativity, love for what he did and I, it shows i think it was very important for me was for them to come up with the look his incredible team hun kim who is his creative director at karl Lagerfeld, and the amazing 84 year old anita who has tailored the this dream exquisite creation you know, they've worked with Carl for so many years. They've been with him. They truly understand what he wants. But it was a lovely collaboration with Han and, the, and his team because they wanted something that I would feel very comfortable with wearing as well. And I really enjoyed working with them because you can hear Carl's voice almost. It was very interesting what they felt and how they saw as they created something with Carl in mind. The thing that gets you into the right space is having a team that helps you look the part. And now I have Daniel and Christoph. Without them, whatever mantra wouldn't work. <laughs> <laughs> the most important thing about the look is we want to fit it around the dress as well, because the dress is the most important thing. It's the Karl Lagerfeld dress. We talked about this, right? We did, yeah. yeah. We and, wanted to show off the neckline. Mm -hmm. And to be able to do that, we agreed that, you know, it should be off. We just kind of wanted a really beautiful structured knot bun. And we left out these little fanned out ends. So it kind of gave it a little bit more of an edgy kind of vibe. And then we thought we'll do dramatic eyes. Yeah, it's something we did in Paris last summer. So yeah. we're a revisiting this strong eye. The eye is kind of like a smudgy extended liner, but she has really incredible brows. So if anything, I just follow what she naturally does. It's still dramatic and not so harsh. It has to complement each other. And I have the most amazing jewels from Cartier and the Richard Mill watch. Everything has to come together. Otherwise, you know, it would not it work. Fall, right? falls apart. <laughs> I think if you ask all the ladies who've ever worn Karl Lagerfeld before, I am sure everyone will tell you it makes them feel special and very chic. <laughs>